Hello everyone! Welcome back to the Emuelic Masterclass. I'll be your host today, Amy Chicken. What do we do when we first get our micro SD? That's right, we open it up. Yeah, it looks pretty good, this. It's got SanDisk written on everything. Whoa! Slow down. Don't get excited yet. It doesn't matter where you bought your micro SD, be it Amazon, AliExpress, there is always a danger of getting a fake product. This may look like a sand disk, smell like a sand disk, but does it walk like a sand disk? We'll need a USB micro SD reader. This little thing ain't that great. So make sure you use something more reliable like this. This is an SD card reader, but with an adapter, you can use it just fine. Let's -a go. First, let's check the differences between a fake and a genuine. First, fakes may have a slower read and write speed. Second, cache memory may not be present. I'll slow it down. Third, the fake may be lying about its size. This is extremely common, and the card essentially eats itself. This will eventually make the micro SD unreadable, hitting corruption levels of a politician. Where's my save game gone? The game was working earlier. How come it's not working anymore? Thankfully, we can check for these fake capacity cards by using some free software. If you check the description below, there's a link with a lot of information. 11 ways of finding fakes. I'll show you the one that I use often, but if it's no good for you, you'll have 10 alternatives here. The one I use is Fake Flash Test. Click on the title and you get to the website. If you get a security error, don't worry, this is perfectly safe. Wink, wink. So go to Fake Flash Test here, click that. There's also more reading if you wish to do so including how to repair the memory device. How cool is that? At the bottom, we'll find the download links. I'm going to choose the very bottom one, latest version with no password. Make sure the micro SD is attached to your computer. Check the drive letter in Explorer. System, See special the techniques, the character I'm going to start stashing, fake running. Flash test. At the pop-up, we'll hit yes, then OK. And then we'll choose from this drop down here, our micro SD, which is G, and then push quick size test. If any data is on this drive, it'll be destroyed. But as this is a new micro SD, there is no data to destroy. Okay, this one's passed, so we're good to go. If you get a fail, please try a different USB reader. You could try one of the other pieces of software. If you do get a failure, quickly dispute your product. Get your money back. Anyway, let's hit OK and then exit. Reinsert the micro SD. And then format. Here I recommend using a file system as XFAT. This is the most compatible and you can use very large pieces of data. Hit start. OK. And now you can use your micro SD for storage. It is crucial to check your storage medium when you get it. For less stress, peace of mind, and a happier wallet. I'm Amy Chicken, and I hope you have a nice day. See you soon.